So, what is this? Is this a giant pencil sharpener? Is that what this thing is? Well, actually, no, it's not. It's a $2 item from a liquidation outlet. These are instructions for it. You're supposed to actually use this thing, that's right, to do a carrot. How in the world do you do a carrot with this thing? So we're going to find this out. First we're going to open it up. There's your backing. See? Look at that. Looks like a carrot. This is all there is to it. Now, this thing, look at that. It's where you're supposed to put your carrot in. Now, on the other end, you got yourself a carrot peeler. So you can peel the carrot, apparently. Not really, I don't know. Because this hole is like a certain size, so you're not going to get gigantic carrots in this thing. You might get like pieces of them or something. So first of all, we're going to need a carrot. And this is our carrot. Now, hopefully it'll fit in there, but what you're supposed to do is take this thing. I don't know how well this is going to work. This is kind of comfortable, though. It's easy to hang on to. This blade's not in the way, so it's not going to cut you in any way, shape, or form. Which isn't too bad. Yeah, it's, it's kind of comfortable. So you can hang on to it like this. And you just take it. And you peel your carrot. Now, I suppose if you had a bigger carrot, you'd probably keep peeling it until it's down to where you want it to be. So, like I said, this little hole right here, it's rather large, because this is my thumb. I'm going to take this. Hold the lights. It's easy to hang on to. I like the way you hang on to this thing because it's just like right there. Stick your carrot in it. And there you go. You can actually peel your carrot. It's like a pencil sharpener. A giant one. In actuality, you could actually use this. As you can see, there's your carrot. There's your carrot peel. So you can use that for decorations on your side or your plate. Or you can cook it, or you can use this as like basically a side. You can actually use that for one of those giant pencils you buy in the dollar store. Because this thing is durable enough, I think, to actually use as a giant pencil sharpener. Or you could use that for like basically your carpenter's pencil. But this, you just stick it in there. It actually works. It works really well. I like the quality of it. I like the fact that you can hang on to it. Like, it's really easy to hang on to. This is where you hang on to it. Your blades are not in the way. See, I'm not cutting myself. Well, I hope I'm not cutting myself. Because it won't slide all over top. So, I wouldn't let your kids play with it because of this blade right here. But it's actually pretty easy. Under, kids, under super parental supervision, you could probably let your kids play with it. It's really easy to use. So actually, for decorating your plates and stuff, if you're like a chef or something, you got some like potential here. And this is like really, this is, I like this. So I'd probably give this thing two thumbs up. This was cheap, as you can see. It only cost two dollars. Now, it was at a liquidation store. And it works extremely well. So this little puppy right here is a definite pass for me. And I'd say thumbs up.